In this tutorial, we will cover the basics of splitting, shifting, and adding silence. In my example, the top track is a poem and the bottom track is music. Let's say that I want to create gaps in the poem and have only the music playing. This is where splitting, shifting, and silence come in handy. Here, at about 12 seconds, you can see that there's a small gap in the poem. This would be a good spot to just let the music play for a while. I'm going to click the middle of the silent part, go to Edit, Clip Boundaries, and Split. The shortcut for this on the keyboard is Command or Control I. To create a gap, click on the Time Shift tool, located in the toolbar on the top left. You can use this tool to just click and drag sections of the track. Gaps in your sound aren't necessarily bad but they can be tricky for your computer to handle when converting your sound file and sometimes end up sounding staticky. The best way to avoid this is simply to fill your gaps in with silence. To do this, click on the edge of the section, drag the mouse to the other edge so that two yellow lines appear. The yellow lines let you know that you are precisely at the beginning or the end of the section. Once you've highlighted the whole gap, click on Generate, Silence, and OK. Two black lines appear at the beginning and end of the silence you just generated. To get rid of them, you simply click on each one. You can repeat this process at various points throughout your track to get the desired effect. You can use your knowledge of basic editing and fading covered in tutorial number 4 to further enhance your track. That pretty much covers splitting, shifting, and adding silence in Audacity.